we do have a long day ahead of us today. We are working on the Honda Civic SI. Finally, we'll get to actually revive the luster of this paint and uh, we will be doing a paint correction. As you guys know, the paint on this baby, it's just horrible. Lots of paint chips. I'm not sure what we're gonna do with that. Hold on, Chester. Let me just let Chester in here quickly as he always wants to hang out with daddy here every time. Come on, boy, let's go. Good boy. Woo. Here he goes. Wanna hang out here? You wanna hang out here, boy? Good boy. Anyways. So basically we are going to do some paint correction. Anasai, as you guys have seen Anasai one time, he came over with his Skyline GTST and he made me drive the car. If you guys haven't seen that video yet, check it out. It's my first time driving a right-hand drive manual and uh, it was a lot of fun. It was a, quite a car, that's for sure. Check that out in the channel, guys. Anyways, we are going to do some paint corrections on the SI here, as I mentioned. Hopefully we can make it looking like as shiny as the Golf R and see how this turns out. I'm not really sure how, what we're gonna do with all this touch-up paints here and there that are not even matching. We might have to touch up and sand things down and see how it goes. So we have a few dents as well, but uh, we'll probably get that done at some point in time. But you guys can see the condition of this paint is not so bad from the camera, but if you guys get really close, you can tell how bad it is. It's horrible. There's even spots where there is stain of some sort, as, as like right, right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, there's a stain of some sort that needs to be touched up for sure. The roof, everything needs to be touched up, guys, and see how well this turns out. So anyways, guys, stay tuned. There's Anasai. How's it going, man? You got a good start. You got a good start here, I think. Nice weather. Yeah, she's looking dirty, huh? <laughs> yeah, you got a bit of um, poopies there, I think. So, hi, Chester. Stop it. Stop it. So, yeah, I, I, figured, I figured I'll just park it this way and work it this way. What do you think? Yeah, good? Okay. Do we need to uh, wash it? In that sense, we'll probably roll it out. And then do a wash in the front. Yeah. Right over there. Yeah, okay. I got all the Equipments. Everything. Nice. And everything for it. All this paint chips and stuff that. Yeah. How did it turn out? Did well, I I didn't actually uh, put more into it. I just it was like that. I just I didn't even get the chance to actually fill it up even more. Okay. So, but. What do you think? Like, is it something I can do while you're doing parts and then... Technically, you would let it... Cure. cure. 
Oh, for a while. Yeah. Okay. You know what? Let's just buff over it for now, yeah. and then I'll just do the touch up at some point, and probably get you come back again yeah, at some. Yeah, because. Yeah. I could always do uh, like this part for free again. Don't okay. For it. I'll, Thank you. I'll do the whole car. Awesome. And then over winter, you can touch these up. And yeah, and then we can come back again for. That's awesome, man. The bottom line is, at least if I can get some of that scratches and stuff that's there, there's even like a, a bird poop somewhere here, or I don't know, someone puked at it at some point, and uh, it, it burnt the uh, clear coat. You see this? Oh, that'll come off. That'll come off, right? That's a surface thing, so. That will come off. That will come Yeah. Yeah, mainly, I, it's probably been sitting outside for the longest time that... Yeah, right you can easily get that out. No, it actually won't. It's into the paint. Oh, it is, hey? I've done full polish and uh, ceramic coating on this. That's crazy. So what do you do to get it out? Just, uh, it's, so you can't take that out then? No, I have to get it repainted. Yeah, the acid on those poops, they're really pretty bad. It's crazy, right? Right, yeah. Great, you got all your equipments yeah. all set up. All right, let's get set up here and then yeah. we'll go from there. All right, time to wash the car here. Time to foam. What kind do you have? Ah, nice. Be a nice fan on that thing. So what type of pads you are using there? Uh, since your body here has a lot of swirls, I'm going to be using the microfiber. Okay. Pad. It's the hardest cutting compound or pad that you could use. Nice. And saves a lot of time, saves your clear coat. Cool. Instead it's, of burning it with yeah. a less uh, aggressive one and trying to get the swirls out. Hopefully it should look good.
Is that your serpentine belt? You want to replace it? Is it is it hard or what? No, it's brand new. Oh, it is. It's just. I did the whole timing and then it just loosened because it broke it. Ah. Uh, after it loosened, then it starts breaking, and now I I tried tightening it again. Yeah. And I need to take apart the whole basically the whole front end of the. Engine. Oh, to do that. Oh no. I'll do it over the winter. Okay. Winter project. Yeah, exactly. It is so cold. It is. Thanks, man. Well, guys, NSI just left and uh, we completed the uh, restoration of the paint on this baby. It's not 100%. It's not perfect, but it's done really well, guys. And uh, it's looking a lot better than it used to, as you guys can see. And uh, can't wait to drive the car. Oh, man, it's so nice. It's so... Let me flip the camera here quickly. As you can see, guys, it's really, really shiny now. Very deep, deep gray, that's for sure. The top as well, repaint or buffed out and all the swirls are almost gone. We don't wanna to go too deep on it because we truly don't know how bad the paint is at this point. We pretty much left the hood, you know, we just buffed it quickly because I still have to work on all those little uh, nicks here pretty much so we will revisit this at some point in the winter time and get it even done well so as you guys can see nicely done nicely done can't complain yeah if you guys need any buffing work um, anasai has really done a great job here uh, zen uh, detailing there's a bit of a uh, dust here because we opened the door and all the dust just flew back in here. But anyhow, it's looking nice, guys. Zen detailing. I hook him up and uh, he'll, he'll do a great job for you guys. So anyways, until next time, guys. Peace out.